She announced on Tuesday that she was quitting BBC Breakfast after nearly 20 years. And Louise Minchin has given fans a glimpse into her chic Chester home via social media, showing off the property that boasts rustic furniture and a large garden. In 2017, the presenter, 52, also did a glamorous photo shoot from inside her living room which had an built-in fireplace and floor-to-ceiling windows that bathed the room in light and opened out into her spacious garden. Louise has also decorated the space with plus sofas placed in a circle around the fireplace with a large square footstool that could also double as a place for her pet pooches to rest. The presenter has made sure she has space to exercise while at home during lockdown, as she also took a picture while using her Peloton bike which had been set up in a separate room. She has also added a chic touch to other rooms in her home as she's shown a glimpse of stag decorations and a pot of flowers and stylish lamps. The host first presented the show in 2001 in London before moving to Media City in Salford, Greater Manchester, as a lead presenter in 2012. Mrs. Minchin, who will leave later this year, said she had decided it is time I stopped setting my alarm for 3.40 in the morning but will take so many memories with me. Among the major stories she has reported on from the last two decades have been the last three general elections. Brexit and the Manchester Arena bombings. Mrs. Minchin also covered the aftermath of the Bad Ackland Theatre attacks, live from Paris, and fronted the program's Wake Up to Menopause campaign in 2019. She said she had lots of really exciting adventures planned relating to her passion for endurance sport and is trying to write a book about that, while continuing with her podcast her spirit about the mental and physical benefits of sport and exercise. Mrs. Minchin also said she was excited to be having lots of luck ends after leaving BBC Breakfast which is broadcast from 6 a.m. to 9.15 a.m. on BBC One each day. Among the stars she has interviewed are Sir David Attenborough, Kate Middleton, Billie Eilish, Jeff Goldblum, George Clooney, Angelina Jolie, and Joanna Lumley. Mrs. Minchin, who has two daughters with husband David, appeared visibly emotional during today's show as she confirmed that she would be leaving. She told viewers this morning that she had loved being on the show but it is time I stopped setting my alarm for 3.40 and is now looking forward to lots of lying. Mrs. Minchin added that she would leave some time after the summer and would take lots of happy memories from her time on the program. She said, We've had fun times. We've had some incredible guests. I love hearing people's stories. I love being able to tell their stories. Asked what she would be doing next, Mrs. Minchin replied, Anybody who watches will be very well aware my passion is endurance sport, and I will absolutely continue to do that. I've got lots of really exciting adventures planned. I'm trying to write a book about that as well. And I'll continue with my podcast, which is all about the mental and physical benefits of sport and exercise. And I'll be having lots of lie-ins. That's what I'm most excited about right now. The presenter also said in a statement, I have absolutely loved being part of the six million strong BBC Breakfast family, but after nearly two decades presenting the program, I have decided it is time I stop setting my alarm for 340 in the morning. I will take so many memories with me, including reporting on the shock and anguish of the Manchester Arena bombing, starting a national conversation about menopause. And the life-changing moment I took part in the Breakfast Christmas Cycling Challenge, which inspired my ongoing passion for endurance sport, which I will continue when I leave. A big thank you to everyone who has watched and supported me. I have loved it and I will miss you all. She took up endurance sport after competing in a cycling challenge and has gone on to compete internationally for the GB triathlon team in her age group. Her BBC Breakfast co-host Dan Walker tweeted, as with everything she does, Louise announces her departure from the show with dignity and class.